What do the following have in common? Hypertension, hepatitis, anemia, enlarged heart. I got them all, and you could use them to fail me out of my job. More importantly, they could kill you. If you Hindus are so smart, how come 98% of you live at the dump? Warning. The opinions expressed by Detective Everett Backstrom are not approved by the Portland, Oregon Police Department. I get murdered. I deserve it. Always and every time. They are expressly his own. The body was found by a campus cop doing a 6 a.m. security sweep. The body's been dead for less than three hours. Maybe it's a heartbreak situation. Romeo got Julietted, hanging himself with his own shoelace. I'm declaring this death a possible homicide. Why? Why? Homicides, the department covers meals. Suicides, we're on our own. Who's up for a hot breakfast? I am drunk as drunk. I will administer a Corsican folk remedy. What do I need to know? Go oh! Let's consider the possibility that Toby had recently fallen in love. With someone he's ashamed of named Cass, so probably fat or hair lip or something. I didn't kill Toby, that's the truth. And the question you're asking yourself right now, the answer is... Lethal injection. Do you think the Percival's will let me go to Toby's funeral? I'm a senator burying my son, the drug dealer. Why wouldn't I want the black stripper he's banging showing up in front of the TV cameras? So, the deadliest special on the menu is named after you? I hate you. Thank you, sir. Sir? Maybe a muffin. <laughs> Toby diminished me as a man. No. What'd Toby do? Hot dog butt stuff? Super glue your boy bits together and play tug of war? Put sugar in your coffee? <laughs> I'm a rich kid with a pound of heroin. Where did I get it? Wooden hangers. That's when you know you got too much money. How do you know the hanger trick? I was a boy. Boys hide things. A pound of heroin. It's your dilemma is whether to charge you for the murder or the drug dealing Viet Cong you replaced. Oh, look. This has got one of those slimy drug lawyers on retainer. I'm gonna insist that you pay for that. <laughs> Deb told me I'm gonna die because I'm too big hearted. Who's Deb? My doctor. Well, no, she's right. She's a he. Oh, look at you, having a drag queen for a doctor? Why do queers make everything so gay? Sir, I left the hemp bag on your desk. It contains an array of African teas. It's, it's to help you rid your body of toxins. Then can I eat cheese? Toby left you a thousand bucks. What for? Boob job? Junior college tuition. Oh, I'm a stripper, but what I really want to be is a beautician. <laughs> we know you loaded the gun. We found your fingerprints on the bullets. I didn't know it was broken. How do you know now? You're a racist pig who hates women? There she is. You're under arrest for the homicide of Tobias Percival. This is my prescription. Make a friend? What am I, sick? You have one week to fill the prescription or back you go to traffic. Dr. Deb. One. Knowing I don't have long to live gives me the courage to do what's right. Two. Deb is a girl's name. You see the worst in yourself and you apply it to everybody else. I don't see the worst in everybody. I see the everybody in everybody. Oh. Did you do that on purpose?